All right, so uh, today I'm going to kind of cover something that that bugs me, and I, uh, is the seatbelt chime on this vehicle. It's pretty aggressive and fairly annoying. Uh, so we're going to go over kind of uh, how to get rid of that. And I'd, I'd always advocate for wearing a seatbelt. I'm a paramedic by trade, so always wear your seatbelt. Um, but, you know, sometimes you just want to, like, run up to your mailbox or, like, say in my case, when I pull up to the car line with my son, uh, right to kind of speed the process up, right as we're pulling up, he goes ahead and unbuckles his seatbelt, grabs his backpack. That way, as soon as I come to the stop in the car line, he can just jump out. Well, that whole time, the the thing, the the chime is just going off like crazy, and of course, it's it's so loud. You know, people on the outside can hear it. So, anyways, uh, I'll just kind of just show you here. I don't have my seatbelt on at the moment, and I'll just start to back up, and and there it is, like instantly. Um, and it gets progressively louder as it goes along. So anyways, how we're gonna get rid of this, I'm gonna go ahead and put the e-brake on just to keep me, cause I'm on somewhat of a slope. So we'll shut the car off. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and open and shut the door just so it kills everything. Go ahead and have your seatbelt in hand here. Um, and what we're gonna do, you gotta do it in about a 30 or so second window. You're gonna rotate the key to the on position and you're going to click the seat belt in and out 20 times uh, within about a 30 second window and then you'll shut the key off and that should disable it. So let's give it a shot here. So we'll turn the key on and then let's do this 20 times. I went ahead and did it 22 just for safe measure. So now we can shut the shut the car back off, turn it back on, let's start it up. Now that's the normal chime that you're hearing there. That's just your your standard startup chime. So see belts off over here. Let's try to take off here and see what happens. And there you go. No more chime. So just remember uh, key to the on position, not started, just on and then click it in and out, in and out 20 times. Like I said, I did it 22. Uh, I just did just a little bit over for safe measure, just, just in case for whatever reason, one or two didn't register properly. And that should take care of it.